Hello and welcome to Inner World Peace, where we come together to meditate and to sing the mantra that brings us into peace, inner peace and outer peace. And I want to talk today about starting from where we are, because at this moment I'm not at all peaceful. As you all know from your own life that life happens, things happen and life is not always peaceful. And the whole purpose of everything is to bring ourselves into inner peace in order to be able to connect to this world peace. So I chose to record before I'm in my own peace uh, so we can do it together. So I think we can all benefit from some ah, releasing in this new moon. It's a little bit intense. Okay, so uh, if you don't mind, we will start together and we'll start with a breath and the movement of the hands just to settle ourselves, center ourselves, and let ourselves go into no time, no space, into other kind of um, state of mind. Literally another brainwave. So let's breathe. <sighs> and with this, let's invite bringing kindness to where we are, to the imperfection of who we are to the impatient part of who we are. I'll take another breath. Let's bring forgiveness to who we are, to the perfection of this moment. Take another breath. Let's bring in acceptance to who we are, where we are at this moment. And I'll just follow the energy of the guidance and let's feel the area of our hearts. So what I see when I attune to our collective thing, that there is a sense of sorrow. It can be a personal sorrow, it can be a collective sorrow, it can be sorrow for someone else, but there is kind of a sorrow. And we all have it somewhere else. So make it personal for yourself, where it is in your life. Close your eyes and just give fine tuning into your own heart, into your own sorrow. I know it's not the place we want to go, but this is the only way we can transmute that into something new and hopefully brighter. So let's just feel our heart and sense your body and sense where it is that there is heaviness with total acceptance of what is. Allow that to show itself, don't scare it. And feel yourself sinking more into where you are. <sighs> Breathe if it's necessary. And look at your body and your energy field just sense your head but also look at your head look at yourself from the side how do you look what is going on what do you sense where is it heavy so so i feel for many of us it's from the throat until the center and it's a sorrow about something that keeps repeating and the fear that it will not change. Ah, let's just breathe into it. Take another breath. And allow yourself just to be sitting here. So I'm going to ask what is the collective intention we are gonna do for today because I kind of left it open. And I think that we will do that. We will focus our energy and the mantra of the Ha'oponopono mantra into the collective sorrow that there's around our planet and around people and around different nations and around different animals and plants. There is kind of a sorrow about the suffering that you have in your life, but that also that exists. 
because this whole week I was tuning into the earth and to, I wanted to do this today about the earth, we kind of left it open. So we can tune into the sorrow of the earth and the sorrow of us with our relationship with the earth. Some of us feeling a lot of people, lots of native people around the world. Of course, it's very, very clear. There is a kind of a feeling of sorrow that we are disappreciated our earth, that we, part of us mishandled it. So we want to release this sorrow and to have this relationship between humans and the earth being kind of purified. And we do that with love. So you can focus in this mantra today about yourself and your own sorrow. I know some of us have very uh, painful things happening in relationships. For some of us, it's confrontation of sorrow with our own self and a feeling that we betrayed ourselves. That's also playing a lot. And we just want to breathe and sing this mantra to release the sorrow. So we are commanding that this energy of love that we are inviting is to cleanse and to nurture and to release the debris from sorrow that we carry in our body, that we can carry in our family line, that we carry in our relationship, that we carry collectively. And we let that be honored, loved, as you will remember. I'm sorry, please forgive me, I love you, thank you. So we release this sorrow or this relationship, old relationship humans had to the earth. You follow your own guidance and follow your own need if you focus on yourself. The field that we are building is going to take care of the rest. again. Okay. And if you feel sensations in your body at the moment, this is just to be watched and cared for, but not worried about. There's a pain in the body or inconvenient feeling. We are saying to that too, I'm sorry, please forgive me. I love you, thank you. And just a lot, a lot of self-compassion, self-acceptance, self-love. That's where it all starts in order to shift things outside of ourselves. You can really feel the beauty of so many souls. It's just like magnificent. Like sometimes I wish that humans who feel the pain of everything that could see how much love are coming from the and elemental world and from the trees kingdom and from the animal kingdom. I mean, we we think that we are being judged and that they're angry with us, but it's not really true. They are such a such a strong connection from the light. They are really at service of the light and humanity, but of the light for this earth. So the feeling that we are um, unforgiven, it's in our own heads. It's not the truth. The truth is that the source of light and the earth and all of the animals and uh, the nature is loving us unconditionally, waiting for us to be able to love ourselves as, as much. So for that, we breathe again. And I stay in this tune, in this mood while I will put our meditation on so we can do it together. We can start our Onapo Mantra together. OK. 
Okay, let's go. Yeah. You are welcome to join us in this inner world peace. In this Haponopono mantra, you are going to bring yourself into inner peace and help us all create a beautiful, field of light. In this intense but special time, we need to be mindful about how we use our personal power. You have so much power in your mind, in your body, in your heart, and in your spirit. And those four voices can help you create the world that you want for yourself. And together we can create the world that we want for ourselves and our children. The first power is the power of your spirit and your intention that you bring into this mantra. Our intention is to create inner peace in ourselves and outside ourselves. Your second voice and power is the power of your mind and the ability to focus and visualize what we are creating. We are focusing on seeing the field of light of people that are joining and lighting themselves up into the same intention. Your third voice is of your physical voice, where you bring your body and your singing voice into this mantra to bring yourself the joy and expression that comes with your voice and singing. The last voice is the voice of your feeling heart. You bring your feeling into this mantra so you can expand yourself and share your beauty with us. Take one big breath and allow yourself to feel your body from your toes to your belly to your head. Bring an inner smile on your face another breath. Feel the area of your heart and picture a person, a place or an animal that makes you feel love. Take another breath and expand your heart also to the back of your body and know that now with this mantra you're going to expand your love to yourself. In this Haponopono prayer, we will use four sentences and you are directing that to yourself as a child. The purpose is to create self-love and self-forgiveness and to bring inner peace. Allow yourself to feel all that you feel and connect to all of us who are just doing the same. So here we go. We connect our inner voice with the intention to create inner peace and world peace. We connect our mind voice to visualize picture yourself as a child or a person that you love and allow yourself to see all of the lights of other beings who are doing the same 
With your voice you can sing, with no expectation or judgment, just as you are. And with the voice of your heart, you allow yourself to feel. One big breath. And let's start.
thank you so much for joining us and bringing us off into inner peace for world peace. I hope you are feeling better and brighter and nicer. And you're going to have an amazing new week. Thank you. Bye-bye.